Did you know that your emotional and spiritual health can significantly impact your physical well-being? Today we explore the profound connection between the state of our hearts and the health of our bodies. Imagine a man named John. John holds a high-stress job, harbors deep-seated unforgiveness towards a former business partner, and struggles with the shadows of past failures. Despite his success, John often feels overwhelmed and physically drained. His story isn't unique, in fact nearly 70% of adults report that stress affects their physical health. Now consider unforgiveness, a burden many carry silently. Research suggests that those who choose not to forgive are more likely to experience higher heart rates and blood pressure which over time can lead to heart disease. Unforgiveness is like drinking poison and expecting the other person to die. Depression, another thief of health, affects over 300 million people globally. It's more than just sadness. It's a condition that can degrade one's overall health, leading to weakened immune systems and exacerbated chronic illnesses. Hatred and holding on to grudges can also take a toll. They trigger stress responses in the body, releasing a cascade of harmful hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. Fear, too, is not just an emotion, it's a biological process that can affect every part of our body, from our brain to our digestive system. Living in a constant state of fear is like living in a body that's perpetually under siege. So how do we combat these spiritual and emotional maladies? The answer lies in seeking strength beyond ourselves. In the scriptures, Philippians 4 verse 6 tells us not to be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. It's time to lay our burdens down at His feet, to ask for healing not just of the body, but of the heart and spirit. To seek a life of abundance as promised in John 10 verse 10, where it is said that He came, so that we might have life, and have it to the full. Let's conclude with a prayer. Heavenly Father, we come before you today, seeking your peace and healing. Help us to release the chains of unforgiveness, the shadows of past hurts, and the weight of our fears. Renew our minds, and heal our bodies. We ask you, to guide us into a life of health, abundance, and everlasting peace. Teach us to walk in your ways, and to trust in your plans. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you for joining us in this journey towards holistic health. May you find the strength to heal and the courage to forgive, not just for your spiritual well-being, but for your physical health too.